How do you all get closer? He texts me a lot of Star Wars memes. Yeah. Normally, by sharing this much Star Wars memes, I don't think you'll be able to get a girl. <laughs> when she responded to my memes with Star Wars memes, I was like, Ooh, <laughs> hello there. Hello there. General Kenobi. Hi, I'm Caitlin and this is Mark, my former boyfriend. And Caitlin's my ex-girlfriend because we're now engaged. <laughs> Mark and I are huge Star Wars fans. We buy a lot of Lego nonsense. <laughs> yeah, the amount of Lego I have. Yeah. My mom is screaming at me. Well, sometimes he's very uncle, but sometimes he's also small boy. Like he go Lego store, he turns into a small boy. Mark and I met at a lightsaber sports group called the Saber Authority. Yeah, I was still a newbie learning all the ropes and he was one of the coaches. I was paired up with him for one drill and he was like, Oh, I'm very impressed. This is only your second session. So I was like, yes, I'm a Jedi. <laughs> so I really like to fight with the staff. He was really good at staff. Sometimes some of us will arrange meetups to train on our own outside of class. That's how I got to know him better. So we got engaged early this year and I had a Holocron ring box made for the proposal. So it was a lightsaber themed proposal and he got all our old TSA friends back, even those who weren't attending anymore. Yeah, he tricked me into going to that proposal spot. After I got down, got our money, you know, you know what the first thing she said? Liar! <laughs> When I first started at doing Sabre, I think my family used to tease me because I think there's this perception that we dress up in costumes and wave your Sabre. We don't actually do fancy full stuff, like scripted fights. We are a lightsaber sports group. So our techniques are based on Kali, which is a Filipino martial art. The thrill of dueling with lightsabers in real time is really something that you cannot match <laughs> anywhere else. We do it as a sport, uh, and this is a very misunderstood aspect of TSA. Most of us are Star Wars fans, not all of us are huge Star Wars fans. But that's only the draw when you first join. For some, it's just a fun form of exercise. Some of them won't do much exercise on their own. And this is a way to motivate them. Usually when we train, we get a lot of feedback from the passerby. Some young people who are walking past us. They'll make all the, Wow, hey, Star Wars! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Because we are training in a public space, uh, there will be some people who will still walk through. Uh. Most of the time, it's small kids because they are very fascinated. We've got lights, they will want to run in and <laughs> want to grab it. Yeah. Like for me, I'm very introverted, but I was really, really interested in sabers and fighting. So that's why I decided to join, even though I was alone. Even though I'm like 24 now, I'm friends with people who are 30, 40, 50 years old. The age doesn't matter because you, when you have common interests, conversation can just flow. Yeah, you really have to step out of your comfort zone and like join an interest group or something that you find joy in. Yeah, I'm glad I did that because I really made good friends and better friends. 